Hello guys, here is my tutorial on how to record uh, uh, video gameplay footage, as I promised. Uh, we're gonna use MS Afterburner 3 uh, Beta 12 to actually record our videos. And because we want to compress the file output on the fly when uh, we are actually recording the video, we're gonna need an external codec. Uh, MS Afterburner allows you to actually do this. Uh, the uh, the codec we're gonna use is X264 Video for Windows. Uh, this is what I recommend, it's really good. There's other codecs out there, but this is by far my favorite. Uh, it's very popular. Uh, download both MS Afterburner and uh, X264. The links are gonna be in the description, uh, so you don't have to pause the video and copy the link. Um, once you've installed both, uh, you, you're gonna need to uh, open MSI Afterburner and the companion application which is RivaTuner. Uh, RivaTuner um, needs to be open every time uh, MSI Afterburner is open so you cannot close it really. Uh, uh, MS Afterburner requires to have a RivaTuner installed. Set it up the way I have set up on the screen and then go on to MSI Afterburner and set select settings on screen display you want to untick this so your videos are not gonna show the overlay you can always set up a toggle key anyway to disable uh, the um, toggle the, this, the on screen display uh, um, while you're gaming and uh, you can also change the corner where, it dis where it's displayed from RivaTuner uh, later uh, go on to video capture, set up a record and stop key uh, on your keyboard. Uh, video format, uh, you're gonna select video for Windows, uh, VFW compression and dot 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 dot. And uh, click on the compressor which is X264, which is the program we've just downloaded. And go on configure. You need to configure this uh, pretty much the same way I have it set up for best uh, 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 for best compatibility and quality. Debug, set to none. Preset, ultra fast, uh, uh, in my opinion is the best. Uh, latency, it needs to be zero latency, otherwise your uh, video game will be pretty much uh, almost unplayable. Uh, this is the most important <laughs> setting in this page, uh, really. Uh, on rate control, uh, select single pass CRF base. You can always uh, use bitrate based, but uh, I've had the uh, sort of I think CRF is the best in my opinion. Uh, 23 is the default value and it's pretty good. You can always lower this value for higher quality. And if you're having issues where uh, your gameplay starts to sort of drop uh, frames, because this will uh, lower your frame rate in the game quite a bit, so bear that in mind. So if um, if you're seeing issues like that, uh, always check that uh, this is ticked, and then proceed to uh, increase your uh, uh, your value for the rate factor, which in turn is gonna lower your quality. Uh, by the way, uh, I recommend 23 uh, to begin with and you can increase up to 18 and after 18 you will struggle to see any difference in quality you've pretty much reached uh, the best you can uh, click ok once everything is set up click ok again uh, container i recommend avi uh, frame size it depends on what you want to do with this uh, i prefer full frame it's gonna record at the same resolution as your uh, video game Frame rate, 30 frames per second. Increasing it too much will lower your frame rate in the game. And uh, bear that in mind that uh, YouTube uh, will not accept any more than 30. Disable any frame limit. Uh, and uh, for the video uh, folder, this is where your uh, output uh, files are gonna go. Well, you need, you're gonna need to set, set one up. Um, audio source, uh, select on audio select. Uh, to record your actual speakers on your uh, on your computer and then if you want to add a microphone this is where you do it you select direct sound and select your microphone from the list uh, if you're uh, a novice 
select mix multiple audio tracks this will record your uh, microphone and gameplay audio at the same time if you want to do some post processing later uh, with programs like Sony Vegas or other uh, free alternatives uh, you can uh, uncheck this uh, this is my preferred method because sometimes your uh, microphone and your gameplay audio are not going to be at the same volume and uh, this is going to pretty much ruin uh, uh, your gameplay video. Uh, set stereo mix and down mix multi-channel audio to stereo uh, for the best results. But anyway guys, uh, this is it. Uh, we reached the end. Uh, remember your video capture key? Click OK and uh, minimize both and you're ready to record. Just open the game, you will see the overlay on the screen. Uh, click on that uh, uh, record key and you will see uh, your videos being recorded with statistics about uh, your file sizes and uh, um, the time uh, from the start. And uh, once you finish, just edit again or close the game and uh, you just need to open your uh, output folder and you will have your gameplay right there. I hope this, uh, this was helpful, uh, thank you very much for watching, please subscribe and rate this video if you found it uh, helpful. Uh, anyway guys, um, I'll see you in the next chapter, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a video on post processing uh, uh, using free software. Uh, so stay tuned for that and uh, bye!